Okay, please state your name for the record. My name is Suman Mazumda. I'm a second year student of the National University of Juridical Science. Uh, I believe you have a Facebook page in your honor. Can you please tell us a bit about that? Yeah, I do have. It was made by <laughs> Deepak Raju and Arnav Basu, but it's just for fun. Nothing else, nothing serious. So law school, you would say, is about fun. Yeah, it's a, there's a lot of fun in law school, but a lot of challenges also. It's a mixture of both, but you have to, you just have to go on with everything. It's just a law school. It's all about challenge and fun. So it's about challenging fun. Both. I say law school is law school have a fun. It's, there's a lot of fun in law school, and there are a lot of challenges you come across, and you have to face that and move ahead. That's a part of a law school. What is? Uh, why did you join this project? Uh, what is? What does this project mean to you? Why do you think it's important? And what is the current role that you're playing? I'm a part of this Bengal chapter of IDI team. Uh, I joined in last May 2010. I started with the Sundarban uh, sensitization program. I went there. The main thing why, which motivated me to join the law school, uh, to join the IDI program, is that we find that in law school there are people from elite classes or people from metro cities but hardly we find any representation from the small towns or say small cities or even villages i've been seeing mp singh who was from a small town and who flourished so much and we it's obviously i thought that there should be also students from small towns who should come to law school who should flourish like professor mp singh and they should make a glorifying career rather than joining some college, some colleges of engineering and medical where the prospect and the dive is very low. And in law school, in law as a career has a big prospect. Have diversity field, you can diversify in lot, lot of aspects. So I think there should be representation from villages, small towns, and cities. Okay, Shamanda, thank you very much. Please state your name. Yeah, my name is Nikhil Kachap and I'm a fifth year student at NUJS. And Nikhil, uh, what uh, brings you to the project? Yeah, because uh, the whole plan, the whole motive behind the thing, it's about increasing diverse diversity and uh, you know helping uh, underprivileged and uh, uh, people who have not been uh, adequately represented. Uh, these people in the law schools and uh, does a uh, main uh, reason why I'm and associated you, with the project. And once you graduate from law school, you, uh, would, uh, you would continue spreading the word of mm -hmm. idea, trying to help uh, the legal profession get more diverse, get better candidates from uh, the marginalized sections? Yes, exactly. As in, I come from Jamshedpur. It's a small town in Jharkhand. And I, and I have always seen, that, uh, as in, people, uh, because of lack of understanding of their rights, uh, they're not empowered and all. So uh, I believe that. Uh, People, uh, as in more and more students, take up law as a career option, and uh, and as of now we have several national law schools all over the country, spread across the country. So opportunities are uh, fantastic, and uh, a lot of people uh, should come up and uh, learn, and, uh, and this would like help bring about empowerment to the marginalized sections and un underprivileged sections. Thank you very much. Yourself, uh, my name is Arnob Basu and I'm a second year student at uh, NUJS. Uh, I came about, uh, as in I came to join this program because I got to know of it through my friends who had already been a part of it. Um, and well, I've been uh, associated with the Bengal chapter of the IDI program and I help out with the logistics and a uh, bit of the teaching here and there. So, Arnab, what is your main motivation? What do you what do you what do you hope to achieve through being involved in this uh, in the idea project? What do you think uh, does idea really have the potential to transform as it sets out to do? Is it feasible? Uh, do you see that in the long term it will make a difference? Uh, idea's biggest strength is the fact that it uh, empowers uh, students. Uh, it uh, creates. It brings in people from uh, such parts of the country which have been cut off from the uh, mainstream.